Hello and welcome to Technology Simplicity YouTube channel. My name is Jay Chung and thank you for today's you know clicking on this video and joining because you saw the title right? 5 minutes to have a complete templates website ready for you. I believe nowadays um, you know as a web developer, designer or perhaps you know a webmaster yourself or perhaps you are a startup owner or you know whoever you are it is okay you needed a website to be in the digital space you know to project your business your service your information 24 7 to the world so you know to start a website definitely it should be a, like this so the great thing about wordpress is the ecosystem is huge and there are a lot of service providers out there that are actually pushing the limits so we are talking about five minutes to have a complete website i'm sure you're like okay is it really true? Is it really make sense or is it really working? Um, do I need to pay? Yeah, there are so much questions here and today I'm going to focusing on showing you the real result by demonstrating to you the 5 minutes to have a complete template website ready. Let's go. Yes, you are right. One more time. Let's quit launch a website in five minutes. And thanks to Cyberchimps, well, the company that actually have been established 10 years plus ago, okay? They've been working around the clock and to make sure the templates are there. And most importantly is, after you import the quick, you know, the website is in template, you actually can modify it easily using the web builder from App Elemental, as well as you know the default good bug that I've been, I've been around for a few years in WordPress. So how does it work? Let's look at it. At first, let me introduce this guy. Yeah, I know it's a banana with the monkey. That's why they are cyber chips. Yeah, all the monkeys like like banana. So put it this way, everyone who use WordPress also like cyber chips. Why? Because the template. Look at this. It's a free responsive WordPress team for you. And it's been downloaded more than a million times. Yes, it's true. You can actually check on the team, you know, in the WordPress repository or the official one. And they have a fully functional website, you know, by just ready to import the demos. So what's great about this, you know, the two parts here is you don't need to worry about it's not web builder combo deeper because these two major are in the best in the market. You know, the Elemental and Gutenberg is ready. So you can actually import based on these two. Number three is is very very lightweight. Yes, so the template is loaded, and if you want to do a speed test for your website, yeah, you can work around. You know, within a zero point nine seconds, we're talking about loaded with a lot of features, as well as using a web builder. Okay, we all know that using a web builder, it could actually slow down a little bit because it's actually comes with a lot of features behind. You know, you sacrifice in a way that. Um, you have a web builder that you don't need to touch any codes but at the same time you need certain frameworks that actually support this but put it this way it's actually super lightweight okay one second is actually it's like yeah it's past really <laughs> okay and it's compatible with php version 5.6 buff and wordpress 5.0 and the buff so yeah it's not really a matter and we are talking about the tons of templates here okay if i may if you look at this way okay you can do the speed test yourself okay if you want try it out since it's free and it's fully customizable and yeah it's tons of features around here so let me show you you know one more time here in the wordpress official website okay you just search for responsive especially it's by cyber chimps so if you can look at this here it's like the active installation is 30 000 plus yeah it's actually a lot let me show you why why this number is 30,000. You know when we actually install a team and after a while actually we switch to a child team, it's no longer an active installation anymore. So that's probably one of it. Then if you look at the ratings, okay, this is the best part that, you know, out of, uh, I don't know how many ratings here. Let me click on it. Uh, I think total you have around 500. Yeah, around 500 ratings, you have most of it. Yeah, sorry, 514 and 4.7 out of 5 star is really, really a lot. Okay, so if you don't trust the developer, you should trust the community because, yeah, WordPress is actually is you or me. 
than using it, okay? So look at this way. Let's start the demo. Okay, go to a WordPress website, go to your appearance. Well, this, uh, I presume you know how to do it. Go to your Teams, add new, and then search for responsive. Then here you go. Just activate it. Okay, after you install, it will actually prompt you to install the plugin. Perhaps some other plugins that necessary. You just click the button and let the magic done. Okay, for the sake of demonstration, I've been done that for you. So we don't really wait for it. Okay, let's look at it right now is what we can really do with this responsive. Right after you activate this team, you actually have this bar on your left hand side here. Let me push you here. Okay, look for responsive on your menu side on the left side bar. Then you shall see this guy called responsive template. Click on it. Okay, click on it. Then you shall see a bunch of templates loaded for you that you can actually preview as well as load the website directly. Okay, for example, I'm an entrepreneur myself. Let's say I'm looking for entrepreneur. So I'm just search for entrepreneur. That's for example. Well, that's one. Okay, please allow me to remind you that this is free. Okay, if there's no charge at all. Then let's say you wanted to actually go for Gutenberg. You can always go to Gutenberg versions and you load the same one okay forgive me if the internet is seems slow here because my internet um is actually slow okay it's not really about the team okay let me switch back to elementor because i prefer elementor version so what you do right now is you just click on this portfolio it shall actually brings you to a preview mode okay where you can actually look at a website yourself okay Give it some time to load if it is yeah because my own survey is actually slow <laughs> well this is the website that you are looking at okay if you like it yeah actually for me i love it i really love this site okay because the way they put it you know the phone types um the logo the layout everything is up per my expectation okay i want this at my website so what i do right now is i have two choices here okay on the top Number one is import the size. What is import size mean? Means you import the whole demo size to your website directly, hundred percent. Okay, including media, including copyrights, including settings, and including all the navigations. You know the menu bar, everything. Okay, this is means import size. However, let's say you just like home page okay i do need other pages you know even though they have this about they have this investment they have these blocks okay i don't need this for example i don't need about yeah i found that okay i have another other versions or i actually just wanted this particular page you can always use this guy called import template okay let me click and show you right now this is what we call import template in terms of page. So you are not actually looking at import the whole website. You can choose which one you want to import. Okay. So this is more like, you know, import just page or you can choose to import the whole size. So for the, for this demonstration purpose, I'm going to show you how to quick launch your whole website in five minutes. So I'm going to click this guy called import site. Okay. You just click on it. Well, this is the same some settings that you actually choose from, you know, is it you need the plugins, you can delete previous import if you done it. And then you can import content as well as you can import a customizer. Customizer is actually stand for the global settings like your menu bar, um, the color team or the fonts type. Okay, it's really up to you and it's very adjustable. I mean, there are a lot of settings here and some description for you. So it's up to you whether you want this or not. Okay, let's say I want everything. Okay, I'm, I'm going to remain, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to untick anything and I'm going to click this import side. Okay, and again, for the sake of demonstrations purpose, I'm not going to fast forward. I'm not going to skip this part. I'm going to show you exactly what is happening right here. So that you know, right, these are the real things before you even try to yourself. So give it a while you know you have some yeah you can eat something uh, you know while waiting for it usually it takes a little bit times in terms of import content especially you know the pictures um, roughly you know let's say there's a 10 to 20 pictures each picture is about 500 kb or perhaps 100 to 200 you do the math and then you will know like okay there are a few megabytes to be imported um you know, it's not really about the server from Cyberchip. Sometimes it's about your own server. 
Do you have a firewall that actually, you know, blocky? You know, stuff like that. It might be slowing down as well. You know, exporting and importing. This is two processes running. It's not just import one site. Um, on the other hand, also, it really depends on your server. Okay, how powerful is your server is? Okay, it really depends. Okay, for me, yeah, I think I just, I think two, three minutes. Let's launch a site right now. Okay, this is my plan new website. Okay, with nothing before. So let's go to uh, incognito mode so that you can see clearly. Okay, testing for dot imjjunk.com. Uh, yeah, if you watch all my videos uh, previously, you know that I've been using testing one, testing two, testing three so far. Testing four is the very first time um, I'm using it, so it's a plan. It's a it's a nothing, and yeah, here we go. We have a whole website ready for me so you see if i click on the about okay the page is here yeah it's i'm actually scrolling purpose to show you that everything's here okay i'm not going to show you the content i'm just showing you that the the site is ready the layout is there everything is there so let's look at it let's say i want to modify certain things okay you can always come to this home page right you can just click on ad with elementor remember just now when i import a site i choose elementor okay because I'm a big fan of Elementor. I'm going to click this guy and I'm going to edit it. Of course, this is actually beyond the launching site because when it comes to editing using an Elementor or perhaps Gutenberg, it's really on how, how you're going to use all the components within a web builder and also your creativity too. But for the sake of you know demonstration, I'm going to show you, let's say I'm going to just change his title to j -Chow. Well, I'm not going to show you too much. Uh, I mean, you know, it can be easily edited. Yeah. Well, entrepreneur, extraordinary, blah, 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 update, and that's it. Okay. I'm talking about a free responsive team that you can import all the demo sites. I'm talking about free Elementor that you can actually use it. So nothing to pay yet. That's the best part, right? Okay. Let me show you one more thing before I end this session. This is the bonus side, okay? Actually, for this tutorial sake, it's done. It's over. It's within five minutes and you imported the whole size, okay? If you want to look at the back end, all the pages are here. All the posts are here. Yeah, it's, this is just a dummy post, okay? And if you look at the media, these are the pictures that loaded just now. Actually, it's quite a lot. So we're talking about loading all these, import all these contents within five minutes. Well, you should be grateful, okay? I'm not sure about your, your country, your, your internet speed, but mine is pretty fast, so... I mean, still okay. <laughs> well, I'm going to show you one last thing before we end this tutorial that you can actually set the customize, the global things, okay? You just go to appearance and then you go to customize. I believe most of you know how to come here. Okay, so if you are using responsive team here, Okay, let me show you responsive here. You should have all this extra. Um, you know, you can change the header. There's a primary header here, you see, that you can actually change to a full width header or you want to inline logo and site title. It's really up to you how you want to do it. And then you can change the uh, header elements with the site branding. You can disable it. Then you shall see the logo actually is disappear with just menu bar. And then you can add it. Then the header layout, whether you want to have a vertical version. You see how, how, how quick I can actually, you know, modify this guy. Well, that's cool, right? When we talk about global settings like the header on the top and then the footer at the bottoms, you know, stuff like that, including the fonts, uh, the typography and stuff. This is called global settings. So you can always come to the customizer here and do your part and then just play around. It's, it's not about the settings actually, it's very straightforward. You know, the site title, what color you want to choose. It's really about your creativity and yeah really about creativity okay yeah a lot of settings here that you can play around you know side line tag line header wager if you don't understand what it is about the best part about the setting here is you have the live editing preview on the sport so 
my my last advice before I end this tutorial is remember if you do some changes, always click publish. Okay, save it. Then you do the second one so that you can erase when you have the problem and you start somewhere, you just click this guy and never save it. That's it. Then you have your original size ready, okay? That's great, right? Well, just I just show you how you can launch a website in five minutes, okay? I know I talk a lot, so that's why this video actually is more than five minutes. But if you look at the demonstration itself, it's actually take less than five minutes. Well, I hope this actually gives you a great idea in terms of how you can launch a website using the demo templates within the five minutes. And thanks again to CyberChimps. Well, you have to choose for yourself. Okay, thank you so much for watching, guys. And now is the time for me to seek a favor from you. You know, as a return, if you really like this video, please do me one favor. Click a like on the video. Then subscribe to my channel as well as put a ring so you get notified next time when i actually upload a similar tutorial video as well as going live every wednesday 8 15 pm thank you so much guys for watching and my name is jay chong signing off techno tcbc youtube channel and goodbye